Welcome to the podcast. Today we are showing you a couple things we got at Comic Con. Yeah. Got a comic book here. The first Hulk. The first Hulk from 1962. Stan Lee Marvel. And he was gray. And then they changed it to. Green. Green! Which is way better. Do you think it's better than gray? Yeah. yeah. It just looks like a copyright of Buff Frankenstein. Yeah. Autograph by Joe Pantanello. I can't say his last name right. But he was in Goonies, Matrix, Daredevil, and Sopranos. Which he's autographed. And he actually wrote Ralphie on it. Which is pretty crazy because he does not like being called Ralphie. That's just a fact. And he made it very clear he does not like being called Ralphie. So, and he's actually never watched The Sopranos. But uh, he doesn't really like watching any of his work. And I said that to him, and he's like, How do you know that? <laughs> Remember that? I was like, Oh, because I watched like a video. <laughs> he's a very cool guy, but in his interview he does not like being called Ralphie or anything except Joe. But I got the pop I've been looking for like two years now. The Queen Alien is sick. Awesome. It's massively detailed in it. Didn't you get it like cheap and she was shocked? Yeah, I got it like 30 bucks and it's like 50. Yeah. And she tried selling you a yeah. uh, cover or a case for it. Yeah, she tried. She's like, hey, do you want this $10 case? And didn't tell me it was $10. And she's like trying mm-hmm. to get me up to 50 And I'm like, she's yeah, I'm to, good. She's trying to make some money. Yeah. yeah. Also, this guy in front of us had the Goonies map, the treasure map. Yeah, and he got it signed. That was cool. He has it signed by all... Uh, most of the actors. I think he only has a couple left. I thought that was really cool. That was really cool. I thought this was cool because, like, this is if you watch Brandon's this picture is a really big deal to that character in the show. But the Goonies map is that's, way better. It's so cool. Way I, was, I was just like, dude, I never even thought about that. And he's like, yeah, dude. And cool people you meet in the line. Um, yeah. And how about you show off your uh, awesome Jaws cup? Yes. I have number one dad. And this dude's got the Jaws Cup from? Uh, Universal Studios. The back in like the 80s, 90s. And what's the picture of? Uh, this was, I believe, the third ride where they had the grenade launcher. Turn the whole thing. This is the... And it's Universal Florida. So... It says it right... Here. There. But it's my, my favorite cup so far. I have duplicates. I have two of them that I found. Mm-hmm. And I found some Batman ones. Batman the Turn. <laughs> <laughs> you messed with me. We got pet sharks down here, bro. <laughs> 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 He'll eat ya. Eat ya. <gasps> Looks like it's eating your head. Does it hurt? How about the ear? Uh, it yeah. Does. <laughs> it has like three sets of teeth. Yeah, it's it's a real weapon. So. <laughs> Be careful. The teeth grinder. Yep. So, we're building a collection from...